How's it going, everyone? This is Rosalind, and we're doing the uh, challenge event, if you can call it that, challenging Weltall Eid for the uh, Xenogears collaboration that's going on right now. As you can see, it's the party I'm using. Uh, this fight's not hard, but I'm just going to go ahead and show why I have this part, this party. So, I'm using a Warrior of Light with 100% dodge and some fire resistance. It's really not that big of a deal. Uh, the majority of this boss's attacks are all uh, either single target or AoE physical. Uh, he does have two magic attacks. One's a single target magic attack that after he uses it three times, he will then use a AoE fire magic attack. And that's the reason I have fire resistance on all my characters. Lid, just whatever. Uh, main unit here I'm using is Fey. I'm just gonna dick around, play, whatever. It's not a hard fight. Volka, it's really not that important. And then I brought Shieta just to uh, raise limit, limit gauge for Fey. Uh, but like I said, the majority of the uh, damage here is all single target and AoE physical, outside of two attacks. And as you, as the boss lowers in HP, then the uh, the types of attacks he can use increase. And everything he does is random, unfortunately. So there's no you know, cues when he'll use it other than the fire magic attack. And the fire, after, the fire magic attack happens after he uses the single target attack uh, three times. The three single target magic attack, so... We're gonna have a little bit of fun here. Uh, the only things to really watch out for is uh, he does have a 40% chance to paralyze on one of his attacks normally, and then once he gets below 80%, he'll start doing two of his single target attacks will start debuffing uh, attack and defense, and then once he gets below 60%, he has a 100% chance to paralyze on one of his attacks. He has a 20% chance to stop on one of his AoE attacks. And then he also has a single target physical attack that has, cannot be covered, evaded, or mitigated by any sort of mitigation. So those are the only things you really worry about, um, but it's really not that big of a deal. Uh, and the boss can be broken um, by everything. So, I mean, it's super easy. But this is more just to show, hey, look, this is how you can do this fight if you wanted to. If you're having trouble with it for some reason. And you can see Warrior of Light took a little bit of damage there. Um, that was from the magic attack. Uh, I believe the boss should be broken. Oh well. Um, really not much to do here. Let's go ahead and throw out a heal. So we can take out the boss at basically any time we want. Let's go ahead and start whittling down its HP a little bit and get it to deal some more damage. Um, I don't want to take it out too quickly, so we'll use some of phase. We'll go ahead and raise his limit break. Get him some healing going. Okay. Um. There's really not much to talk about here. I guess we could talk about Volka. Volka's nice. Um, specifically, actually, something I, I... I figured this is how it works, but I had it confirmed for me today. Um, but with Volka, if you are interested in... using her ability to increase the uh, power of uh, um, other characters' attacks, do note that uh, it doesn't work on a character like Ellie um, from this banner. So, like... It increases water magic damage by 150, uh, and that's actually the base, uh, like I said, the, the base power of the attack. However, that is, as it states, only magic damage. So for somebody like a character like Ellie, who she has a bunch of abilities that just happen to be magic based, those are actually abilities and not magic. In which case, her uh, it's actually this ability right here, this uh, blue mirage. This will not increase the damage of, her, of those attacks. So, 
don't make the mistake that some people on the Japanese side of the game have been making. It's been going around on the Japanese side of the game, on Twitter and whatnot, that uh, Folka increases it and makes Ellie even more broken than she already is. And while she is certainly broken and overpowered, um, the interaction does not work that way. So let's go ahead and prepare just to go ahead and end this. Let's do that. Then we'll go ahead and break the boss. Oops, not double white. Nope, not that either. Okay, yeah, the boss is broken, so just go ahead and use a limit break and get this over with. There you go. Easy fight. 